This is the beautiful Sun Princess, new for 2024, and this is the 4B's full ship tool. I'm Tom from Cruising with the 4Bs. Welcome along, come along on this tour with me. This is where you arrive and disembark by tender or strolling off to discover new cities and places. Hopefully you don't need to use it, it's the medical center. On decks five and six, midship is the Lotus Spa. This is for an extra cost. You'll notice anything that is for an extra cost, you'll see the dollar sign in the corner. Here, treatments, detox, acupuncture, you can even get couples massages. Ooh, ah. All bookable on the app, or just go and speak to the lovely people at reception. Just buy the thermal spa for the week. I was on a 10 day cruise and it was $196 for the 10 days. Up we head to deck six, still midship, and we have the Firefly Park. This is next to guest services, and this is for the younger guests from ages six months to seven years. There's the normal booked program activities throughout the day. You can also stay and play. It looks a really cool area, doesn't it? There's also a dedicated area, play area for ages six months to three years. And the after the ship, with some pretty impressive views, on deck six, seven and eight is the main restaurant. One main restaurant here on Sun Princess. On deck six, it's more formal, a more slower paced surface. It's bookable on the app for the evening, that evening, or it's bookable for the same time, same table throughout your cruise. Also open for breakfast and for lunch. Up on deck seven, a little less formal, you can book, or you can turn up on the evening and see if they've got a free table or just wait a few minutes. And then on deck eight, it goes a little bit crazy as it is turn up and anytime dining. We'll do a full review of all of the eateries on board. Check out the channel. For that reason, that reason alone, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. It's completely free. We have over 10 videos for Sun Princess, as well as plenty of other cruise content on our channel. It's completely free. Give this video a like if you're enjoying it. It helps spread the word of our channel and we really do appreciate it. Next up is the Reserve Collection, the sweet only restaurant. Fan of a guitarist or a vocalist by day, trivia by evening, head to the Wheelhouse Bar. Shops are on decks seven and eight. Piazza is one of the highlights of the ship. Take a look at this. It has those fantastic floor to ceiling sphere windows and the sun pouring in. Including in the piazza is Bellini's cocktail bar. It will transport you to a world of glamour. What's your favorite cocktail? If you like a coffee, I'm British, so I'll have an English breakfast tea, please. Then head to Coffee Currents, where you can also get a freshly baked pastry. Who doesn't like an Irish bar? I'll let you think on that one, as I inform you that O'Malley's is back. It was on Enchantment of the Seas. It is the Irish pub. How about some interactive entertainment, 
some traditional Irish music. It's a princess favourite, it's Princess Life. Play along games, social interactions and comedy shows. Check it out, love it here. Do you fancy some mixology entertainment and some of the best cocktails at sea? Well, it's the Good Spirits Bar. Now, separate from the other kids' area is the tweens' area, 8 to 12s, and the 13 plus goes in the underground. Really cool area here, love it here. You've got things like comfy seats, playstations, air hockey, foosball, and just chilling with your mates. That's the Neon Grove and the Underground between. This is the Princess Arena for nightly production shows. This theatre can have the 270 degree keyhole configuration or be more like a more traditional cruise ship theatre. largest casino in the Princess fleet. Mac the Knife. I won't sing because I don't want to spoil this video, but if you fancy to head back to the Sinatra era to have a signature martini, oh yes, classy, then head to Krunas. Let's once again head back to the Piazza area. and three oriental restaurants. You've got the modern elegant sushi bar, offering amazing views across the piazza. And you've got two restaurants in one. You've got the teppanyaki. I love a teppanyaki at sea. The chefs will be making fantastic food in front of you and also offering some amazing and funny showmanships. If there is a teppanyaki on board a ship, I cannot miss it and you cannot miss it here on Princess. And also there is the hot pot as well. Spellbound. A nightly show, five, seven, and nine on selected dates. 
magic show with a company in meal in the Horizon restaurant on a shared table. Want some fine Italian food, freshly made pasta? It's Sabatini's for an extra charge. To enjoy those Wakeview views, then head to the Wakeview Terrace. Could you imagine now sitting, chilling, having a drink and enjoying the sunset in the Caribbean? Whatever the view, I love a Wake Terrace and this one is on deck eight. You can also head up to deck nine for the promenade and we will have a promenade walk covering the aft of the ship while we take a stroll and take a look at sun princess don't forget to join us on our socials we're going to have loads of coverage every time we're on a ship and we're on tiktok x instagram and we're on facebook as well find us cruising with the four beats let's take a look at the aft of the ship and some more food eateries both of these are for an extra cost. New to Princess is Butcher's Block by Dorero. A family style eatery, perfectly prepared fine cuts of meat. Mm -mm -mm. Tasty. This is the buffet on board, the eatery. This is open breakfast time from around 5.30 until 10. And we've got lunch, dinner, and then some late night snack. Alfredo's is the pizza restaurant on board. It's a casual dining venue. What is a casual dining venue, I hear you ask? Well, you've got to pay for the pizza if you're on the basic package. You get two visits if you're on the plus package. And if you're on the premier package, you get unlimited visits. The Alfredo's, which gets voted the best pizza at sea by New York Times. Wowee, praise indeed. Have a drink at the International Cafe. Decks 10 to 15 are cabins. Wide variety of cabins on board from single interiors, main interiors, balcony, deluxe balconies and suite. We will have a full guide and review of the cabins on board on a future video on this channel. For suite guests, it's the signature lounge on decks 15 and 16. 
You guessed it, for sweet guests only. We're now forward on deck 16 for the sea view terrace and deck 17 is the sea view bar. Check out those views. Deck 17 and 18 is the dome. Wow, it's inspired by Santorini, as you can see. Stunning when the sun is pouring in. It's a glass enclosure, it's indoor and outdoor. It's an oasis by day and electrifying entertainment by night. One of my favorite venues on the ship. It's forward, it is the dome and you don't have to pay anything to be sat in here. Nice and chilled, let's take a look around. This is the Lido area on board. We have pools, hot tubs, fast food, all included. The outlets included tacos, pizza. We've got the bar for your drinks. And you've also got coffee and comb. A lovely outdoor area. This is the Lido area. Let's get physical, let's get physical. It's the fitness center, the fitness studio, and also the Lotus Saloon.
Parks in the Sanctuary with stunning views. Time to chill out. You can get this from $40 per day. Obviously, C days are more expensive. There's a variety of prices. It can be booked. Once you're on board, head up to reception and the fabulous staff will guide you through it. The Sanctuary. One of the highlights of Summer Princess on decks 19, 20 and 21 is Park 19. It's a family activity area created for all ages. Very excited about this. The main event is the Sea Breeze. It is the first roller glider on a ship. Are you brave enough for the Infinity Horizon? Leaning walls over the side of the ship. Ooh, ooh, nervous. Time to chill in the hammock area. Have some fun in the splash zone. Your traditional recreational court on princess cruises and take a jog on the jogging track. What do you think of Sun Princess? Let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. And on the screen right now, give it a press for our tour of the fabulous Sky Princess.